but I made sure to stop and you'll notice. Down, I can't hear you clearly. My top is off. Okay. Well, you th that doesn't like wait, well right? that makes no sense whatsoever. I what's your name, sir? Cano? Yeah. I am a little concerned now. You're you're making allegations. You can't hear me with the top off the car. That doesn't make sense. I had yes. Would it make you feel better if I opened the glove box? That's or? what I'm wondering. Yeah, could you open the no, glove box? No, I'm not gonna open the glove box. I don't answer any questions. I don't answer any questions. You have anything on your I don't answer any questions. Okay. Size officer, I don't uh, answer any questions. You don't answer any questions? No, I do not. Hey, hey, what's going on? We got another reaction video of early in the morning for y'all. Um, haven't seen this one. All I know the title is Driving While Black in Connecticut. And uh, I don't know. Let's check it out. Mama, it says Driving While Black in Connecticut, November 25th, 2020. I don't know where he at, but where I'm at, it's usually pretty cold to put the top down, but oh well. That's, <laughs> that's just the first thing I noticed from the little page, but uh, shoot, let's get into this video. Alright, so I don't know what's going on, but this state trooper's been following me since Lebanon. So I've started recording it, I'm driving in circles and he's following me. I haven't violated any traffic laws. He's on a fishing expedition right now. So I want it documented that I'm going in circles and he's following me intentionally. And he's waiting for a reason to pull me over. So it's coming and I'm ready. All right, so <clears throat> just, 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 um, this only came to my attention because I do get a lot of emails and people reach out to me about um, their encounters with the police and I hear people uh, say things like, like what he just said, the cops on a fishing expedition, the cop might be eventually, but at this point in time, that's not a fish. The fishing expedition comes with the, uh, the questions and when they're looking for probable cause to, to uh, search you and detain you, et cetera, et cetera. I wouldn't, because sometimes I, I get, I get, calls or whatever and people will hit me up and they'll be like man the cop violated my rights and they'll be like well what happened and what they said like it, it can be a messed up situation but it's not a rights violation and um and then when you are describing it if, if he was to call me up and say yeah man i was driving and this cop was on this fishing expedition i would have been like well what how was he on the fishing expedition and he'd be like well he was following me and I'm going to be like, I mean, they, you know, they, <laughs> it's not fun, but they're allowed to follow you. <laughs> and then he, and he says, I was driving around in circles. <laughs> um, I guess it's safe to say he's going to get pulled over. <laughs> but let's see how he handles it. My papers are legit. Done nothing wrong. But this is a perfect example of what I'm talking about. Where our, our officials, our, our public servants, do not act as public servants. This is some bullshit. So I'm keeping the camera on. I'm keeping it rolling. We're going to see what this guy does. Everybody hates this moment. But it sucks because now I can't have the music going. And GPS is redirecting me. Ooh, this is making me dizzy. <laughs> Just driving, trying to figure out when is he going to do it? When is he going to pull me over? And then it's those moments when the cop pulls off and you like, yeah, motherfucker. <laughs> People be police be behind them, they be scared as hell. Two hands on the wheel, sitting straight up, seatbelt on. <laughs> police pull over, they be like, yeah, I knew he was a bitch. <laughs>
God damn, bro. We I, we just watched him drive for five minutes. I gotta start watching these videos before I call him. Well, maybe I'm in danger. Now. Can't read his plate marker. This shit, this shit got me. Follow me some look, look, your heart be beating when you, <laughs> this is a long time to be nervous. And, 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 if and, I and, slow down a little bit and I go 10 miles below the speed limit, he'll try to get me on impeding. Not like, damn. Okay, okay. Well, the video's only three minutes in. And I'm, I'm five minutes in my video, so I was talking for two minutes. All right. But... Yo, this this shit sucks when the police are like behind you like this, and they know that, you, and knows that it makes the average person nervous. So, it's like you're bound to 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 tap the line, swerve. Um, you're bound to make a small mistake, and they know this. Or something. All right, I know their game. I know this uh, cat and mouse with the state troopers. Yo, this better be good. I mean, clearly, I'm going in circles again. All right? So, we're going to see how much of this he wants to do. Because now we're back in Lebanon. See? Here we go. I told you. Looks like the cop is blocking the driveway. He wants smoke though. Dude, 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 could, dude wanted that smoke. He couldn't wait. Okay, let's get this over with. Why'd you pull me over? Over. Yeah, I'm a little concerned and I'm being recording this for my own safety so right now. I. I pulled you over because number one, you almost ran the stop sign up there, so you caught my attention. Uh Hold up. I might be tripping. Hold on. Yeah, I'm a little concerned and I'm being recording this for my own safety and right so now. I. I pulled you over because number one, you almost ran the stop sign up there, so you Hey yo, he said number one. You almost ran over, ran the stop sign up there. You almost ran the stop sign. I don't even know what almost running the stop sign looks like because, <laughs> um, almost don't count. Almost don't count. What the, what the fuck does that mean? You almost, it was like you were almost speeding. You, you, <laughs> you, nah, bro. Almost don't count. Caught my attention. I was a little excited and I do apologize for that, but I made sure. Once again, man. Why were you apologize? Why would you apologize? Don't. Sure to stop and you'll notice. Go down because I can't hear you clearly. My top. Hey, yo. <laughs> yo, the cop said. The cop, hey, we got to run this shit back. The cop said, can you roll your window down? Because I can't. Because I can't hear you. <laughs> Pulled you over because number one, you almost <laughs> ran the stop sign up there, so you caught my attention. I was a little excited, and I do apologize for that, but I made sure to stop, and, and you'll you notice. Down I can't hear you clearly. My top is off. Okay. Well, you th that doesn't. Wait, like well, that makes no <laughs> sense whatsoever. I, what's your name, sir? Cano. Sir, can you roll your <laughs> dudes in the convertible, yo? Tops off.
<laughs> Sir, can you roll your window down? Because I can't hear you properly. <laughs> properly. What are these fucking robots, bro? Come on, bro. <laughs> I am a little concerned now. You're you're making allegations. You can't hear me with the top off the car. That doesn't make sense. I had, yes, I m almost rolled the stop sign. I apologize for that. And you'll notice I made complete stops after that. I don't understand the reason for the rest. Hold on, y'all. I won't do this often, yo, but I gotta hit. This shit is unbelievable, bro. This is worth This is worth watching him drive for four minutes straight, yo. I was a little excited, and I do apologize for that, but I made sure to stop, and you'll know that. My top is off. Okay. Well, you, that, that doesn't, like wait, that well, way. that makes no sense whatsoever. I, what's your name, sir? Cano? I am a little concerned now. You're you're making allegations. You can't hear me with the top off the car. That doesn't make sense. I had yes, I m almost rolled the stop sign. I apologize for that. And you'll notice I made complete stops after that. I don't understand the reason for the rest of this you, traffic. You <laughs> now you're not giving me a chance to answer. Well, because I'm I'm also voicing my concerns as a citizen. I am concerned that you're following me uh, and trying to find I am something. Following you. Right, right. Yeah, so because because you. of you the stop why? sign. Because this intersection is the same one that we started at. So why did you make a big loop for no reason? Baby, I forgot something at home. Where, did, where do you live? I live uh, in North Franklin. Okay. But you know, wait. What? Uh, yeah, why my, my man seem like he knows his rights? Why is he not exercising? Why would you tell him? Don't answer questions. Do you have any identification? I, I, I do. But why is the reason for the stop? Suspicious activity. I'd like to see Sus your license, please. Suspicion's not a crime, though. Let me see your license. I'm doing this under duress, for the record. All right, you can't claim that you're doing anything under duress if you haven't like been threatened. If like, excuse me, the cop would have to say, um, "Give me your ID, or you're going to jail." Give me your ID, or it ain't going to end well for you. It has to be a threat. If there's no, if there's no type of threat, you can't say duress. Like you can't just jump to that. Hey, like, cause that means. That means like a regular person could walk up to you and say, yo, give me a hundred dollars. And you say, hey, I'm doing this under under duress. Like <laughs> that person didn't, it's not, it doesn't work that way. And the same thing with the cop. Like he has to, he has to, it has to be, give me your ID or this is going to happen. There, there has to be, uh, there got to be a little bit more than just asking for it. And um, in this situation, nah, you ain't getting my ID. I'm doing this under duress, okay? I understand my rights. I understand the Fourth Amendment. I got, All... I got, I got more than enough probable cause to pull you over. That's fine. Because your, your license plate says you live in Bristol. Hold on. And you have suspended insurance, So if you, unless you can prove otherwise. So I have more than enough probable cause to pull you over. I, I do have insurance on the car. Okay, well, so I'd that's like not... to see some proof. All right, well, now, while a cop does not, unfortunately, does not have to tell you why he stopped you, this one did. And, um, so, so it's messed up because they don't have to tell you why they pulled you over, but you might be in a situation where they didn't pull you over for anything valid and turn over all of your credentials and, and, um, proof of insurance, et cetera, et cetera, registration. So it, it's kind of, <laughs> it, it's kind of fucked up because like, it's one of those things where it could just be too late by the time you even know whether you should have exercised your rights or not. That that law, that one right there ain't fair. They need to change. They definitely need to change that one. But um, now the cop has given it to him. So that's, um, I mean, and that's in good faith. You know what I mean? That's just, just understanding another person when the nose was going on with them. Like, like you can't really expect, you, you, I don't think you should expect people to just listen to you without knowing the reasons why, but that's me. I have more than a follow cause to pull you over. Well, I asked for your license. I know. I've got it. I've got it in here. And just okay. so you know, even under the police accountability bill, I can still ask for your license. I understand, and I'm cooperating. Okay. All right. Well, you kind of are, but you still haven't well, given me your license. So, be, so license. Okay. okay. I'd like to see it, please. I'm keeping my hands clear and visible. I don't want to upset Can you. Please you. take your license out of your Yes, wallet. I am. Okay. <laughs> He's just being just petty now. Nervous, and I am. What did I do to make you nervous? Well, you've been you following me. Okay. Yeah, okay. I'm following you because you're acting suspiciously. Because life you made a giant loop. Yes, and life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. Yeah, the, Constitution truly, guarantees me, the Constitution guarantees, guarantees me the ability to, me. to travel. And if you truly forgot something at home, why did you make a giant loop instead of just pulling in a driveway and turning around and going? 
See, people, this is why you don't answer questions. He told the cop he could have been driving. And now the cop's challenging what he said. The cop wouldn't have nothing to challenge if you didn't say anything. You don't you just don't say that. You don't, it's not his business where you were or what you were doing. He, I was driving in the giant loop. Why would you drive? Because I like to drive. <laughs> like you don't gotta. You don't even gotta say that. I, mean, I don't answer questions. Going to get it. You're not making a whole lot of sense here, which is raising my suspicion even more. Well, so here, I want you to see. I'm this a still doesn't tell me that you live in Franklin. It still says you live in Franklin. I stay in Franklin. Okay. okay. Where? Uh, in North Franklin. I am stayed at a friend's house. What's the address? 853 Route 32. Okay. okay. Uh, so, yeah, uh, I lived over there for a little bit. I had some problems with my other house. It's not a big deal. Okay. okay. Again, you're so, right. It's not a crime. But I'm allowed to ask these questions. And I'm okay. and I'm in. We've I, had a lot of burglaries in this area, and the way you're acting makes me a little suspicious. So okay. now I'm a burglar, so, burglary suspect. Stay in your vehicle, please. Why did he answer questions, bro? I'm, I'm, don't be the one saying I know my rights and just not using them. But I don't. Under, I never understand that. The state trooper just pulled me over. Oh, he, oh, wow. This is the end of the video. All right. Well, that's it. Um, <laughs> that was interesting for a little bit. <laughs> Thanks for tuning in. I'll be at y'all tomorrow with another one.